Hello and welcome. Today we're taking a look at Unending Galaxy. This is a game that's uh, it's a very strange combination of 4X and Space Sim and RTS. That uh, game came out a few years ago, uh, but it's still being developed. It's it's available on Steam. It's on itch.io also. I actually came across it because it's on sale right now on itch. And it came up on my, my homepage. But I thought we'd take a look at it. It's developed by Anarchist Gaming. The whole idea here is we are a ship. And we're trying to make a quick buck. We can either be a miner, we can be a trader, we can be a bounty hunter or a pirate. Uh, various things. A, a basically a corporation a CEO also is is able, or maybe maybe the leader of an empire. Um, starting out as one ship, we can go around doing all those things, or we can go to the shipyard, of course, and upgrade our ship, buy new ships. We can buy new ships to get for a fleet for us, or maybe we can buy some traders and tell them to go out and do trading on their own to make some money. Uh, all kinds of possibilities. Very complex, really detailed, and there's a lot going on here. And I'll do my best to show off, talk about, explain what's going on here. But let's go ahead and get in here. First off, I should explain the game is not the prettiest thing uh, out there. But, but um, we got several different galaxy maps that have been pre-drawn up. We also have some procedurally generated ones, which we'll go ahead and do one of those. Um, we can show the map here. We can edit it more if we want. Um... The, but each of these colored spots are different empires. Now, the thing about this game, which is really cool, is it's sort of an eco economic simulation, I suppose, to where the, the economy is is dynamic. It, it grows. It, as as you start the game, you see a bunch of trade ships go out, and as time goes on, you know, prices change, and, and goods get teleported around, transported around, and empires grow. So this orange empire in time will, will expand into multiple systems out there. And uh, it's a really interesting idea. Um, so that's that's our world. Neutral Trader, this is going to be where we're choosing our starting scenario. Uh, the Neutral Trader is just where we, we are a cargo ship and we have a, a cruiser along with us. And we're just going to make some cash. That's how we begin the game. We've also got some here where maybe we're just some rich guy. we got a small fleet of cargo ships and a lot of money. And... We're going to make the most of our cash here. Uh, we are part of an empire. Maybe we're a deserter from an empire. This, the draft is one of the factions in the game. We're a deserter. We start with a, a fleet and a bounty on our head. We can be a pirate raider, pirate captain, some rebels. And, uh, yeah, it's an interesting interesting idea. Um, actually, you know what? Let's try this one. Sirak Rebels. You are a Sirak Warlord. You start with a system, a solar system under your control, and enough resources to start expanding right away. That might be a good way of showing off the game. We got a lot of cash here. Uh, yeah, let's do that. So we're gonna go with uh, my name's gonna be Captain Nook, and let's try this. So we can change our faction around if we want to be someone a little bit different here. Um, uh, oh, there's a bunch here. Sure, Cog. Um, now there's two different options here. We've got the default start where we are one ship trying to lead this this thing, or we can just actually be the entire empire. We control every ship. We can manually control every ship, tell every trader what to do. We can manually outfit every ship also. Or we can automate basically everything. Um, we're going to just do the default one here. Uh, let me look. And um, just like any other 4X game, we have these... These are like the different races. Think of Master of Orion. Each race has its own specialties. Uh, positives and negatives. And that's what this is selecting for us here. We are a Syrax, so... Um, yeah, strong colonies in jungle worlds, fast and well-armed ships... Access to firearm and slave production facility. <laughs> yeah, sure. Um, we have different points we can put into how we are too. About we're builders, militaristic, and weapon experts. Yeah, I like it. Let's do it. Okay, so I mentioned right the game is 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 ugly. Um, here is our our space. We've got this sector is ours. We got the we got ship parts. We have trading stations. We have small arms factories. I am one of these ships in here. This guy right here. Uh, I have a fleet that's following me around, as you can see. And we can see who that is right, now, right in here. We've got all our assets. So all these ships in here. Capital ships. We've got capital carriers. We have some builders in here. And uh, some fabricators. These are all following me around. Um, doing nothing at the moment. We're going to tell them what to do in just a minute. The map screen, we can see here. We own this green sector here. This is our entire our solar system that we own. We have other folks out here. we got the Nakar Nebula. Or uh, Nakar space over this way. We've got the planets, some stations in here. Um, this is Ada Katana, which is looks like owned by nobody. There's no color there, and uh, a few different factions out here. So as the game goes on, we're going to expand into new into new places. We'll probably move over here. Maybe we can get some more bases built up and see if we can expand on this thing. Now we're playing kind of 
empire-like, right? We're building a whole empire, but we don't have to play that way. If we want to just be like a neutral trader, we're just a one trader out mining and, and running just one ship. It's probably a little more advanced than I probably should be doing right now, but whatever. Now, I have, um, let's see, a capital, capital, carrier, cargo frigate, you, and you. You two, you two cargo frigates. You basically, you're haulers, right? You shouldn't be following me around. I want you guys to go be free traders. So what they're going to do is they're going to run around to all these different stations over here. You see, they're running to the trade station. He's running out to, I don't know where he went. One's going to the warp gate. They're running out to go do trade. They're going to buy things from the food place, sell it to the military place, and make cash. They're just running a typical trade game. You can see it up here. Um, where we could do manually if we wanted to. We can actually control those ships also. And manually go buy and sell if we wanted to play that kind of a game. But we're an emperor here this time. Uh, building fabricator. So, you, buddy. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to take all you guys down this way. Uh, let me go look at... What are you? Here's a shipyard. Actually, let's go in here. So, the shipyard. Let's take a look at our shipyard. Not not me. Not me. The shipyard. If I can click on it. If I can click on it. I can't click on it because there's things in the way. Shipyard. Okay, so here's a shipyard. Now, we can tell this thing what to build. We can we can select and tell it what it needs to do. However, we have it selected to allow Empire Manager to use the shipyard, which means that we have it set up to automate, automate and he can produce whatever he wants. Uh, I'm fine with that, because I don't really know uh, enough about this. But if we wanted to manually construct all these units, we could. He's building a Dauntless right now. And we can tell him what to do. We can say, when you come out, I want you to join the defense grid. Sure. That's that's your job. I'm gonna actually build a couple of these absolutions. We'll build uh we'll build two of those, and um you know actually actually I'm gonna build five of you. Join the control group one. Um, I can actually come in here. And I can tell you what to make. Also, we want to build what was that? That was a was that a vulture? Absolution. Absolution. We can put all kind of weapons he has on. This thing's pretty big. This is a big ship. Um, this is a really big ship, so we'll let it do. We'll let it do what it wants to do. Um, this is, I guess, a heavy capital. There you go. Yeah, do that. Excellent. Sure. Um, make those and build those five, and they're gonna be in control group one. Then we can go back and, and look at them in a minute. So there we go. We're building some ships there. What do we have over here? My chemical plant. What's my chemical plant? Uh, crystals, chemicals, okay, cool. Now, let's go take our fleet here, and let's find our warp gate, which I think we saw up this way. I'm going to fly up this way. I'm going to keep my, my followers here, because we're going to go see if we can build some things up to the top here. Going, uh, yeah, back back to this sector where all of our stuff is, is at. Right here. We have a warp gate right here. We're going to go there. And we're going to jump to somewhere else. We're going to jump to a different sector and build some more under the base. I'm not sure what the... Um, I'm guessing that we're at war with somebody because... Actually, we can look at that. Let's go to our Empire screen. All right. So, this takes some bit of explaining here. Um, you can see we've got 152 ships, 36 docks. We've got 21 sectors under our control. We're pretty decent size, actually. Um, this is where we can set up... Automation. So we can turn all this off. We could autom If we don't want to automate anything, we can tell, manually tell everyone what to do. We could do that. But with this on, station building is even set up. So we'll build station building ships, and they'll go out and they'll build chemical factories or shipyards out in space, and sort of the empire will expand on its own. We could go in here and manually do it if we wanted to, but we'll let that go happen. Shipyards are being built. We saw that already is set on. Uh, allow your manager to put bounties on enemy ships. Yeah, definitely. We have 10 million bucks in our general account. Our buildy account only has 12 grand, so we want more in there. So let's move, like, 2 million into our building account. So now they got now they have money to go build shipyards and stations and all that. That's where they pull their money out of, the automatic money. This is my money to spend up here, basically. Um, we have our colonies here. We have Vesna 1, 2, and 3, right? We're in this one system. We have no missions at the moment. We have policies we can set up for our empire. We can say, I want you guys to be at war with all pirates. We can say, um, can spawn civilian raiders. Sure, that's fine. Um, hostile mining, foreign mining ships. No. Diplomacy, we are neutral, aggressive with everyone, except for the AI core. Those are the 
bored, basically. Everyone hates them. Um, we have some galactic news going on here. Sorry, Rebels have built a ship. Oh, we did all this just now. We built a solar power plant. Oh, look at all the stuff we've already done. Roy received. Termination of a pirate raider, incinerator, investment. Oh, a pirate came in and we, we killed him? Well, good job, everybody. Well, well done. Okay. Um, now, let's go back. I'm going to go through this gate. We're going to jump. And we're going to go over here. I think. Open space. There's a pirate capital sector. No, we don't want to, we don't want to go the, visit the pirates. We want to go here. Ooh, that's cool. Okay, so now while we're here, we can see there is a bunch of pirate stuff around here. Pirate shipyard, pirate ale brewery. Maybe not the friendliest place to be. Um, but within this sector, I want to go gas giant, desert planet. I want to go here to the temperate one. What? Bounty on Nook Raider Shredder. Nook Science Lab is destroyed. What's going on up here? My Science Lab just... Uh, well, who's putting bounties on... Who's putting bounties on me? All right, let's go back down here. A slave pit. Let's take my fleet down this way. We're going to try to build a base. We're going to go back down into the sector down, down below here. And, uh... And go that way. Now, we, I could manually tell these guys. I can click on you and I can say, hey, you, I want you to move over this way. I want to make sure you follow me, you know, protect me, that kind of a thing. New uh, cattle farm's been built. Good. Because we're still building. We are still cranking out some ships. So the ships should go into defensive mode. We can go check there in a minute make sure they are defending everything. Make sure they're on patrol duty and keeping me alive. Okay, so we've got a planet here and a bunch of pirate stuff. So I want... Not the retribution. Where's the other guy? There he is. The fabricator. Your job. I want you to come over here and I want you to build me something. I want you to make me a... Can you make me a shipyard or can you not? I'm not sure if he can do a shipyard. We'll, we'll find out. Who's putting my Nook Raider Enforcer? Are we like going around picking on people? People are putting bounties on us? I, I guess so. Okay. Are you going to make things... Let's see if he does this. It was great. Oh, yeah, there he goes. Okay, so he's building me a military base right now. Um, and we'll see when he gets done. We're basically building a station over here, and eventually we'll get control of this sector, I think. Uh, we got all kinds of pirate things around, which I guess we don't have a problem with. A missile factory, eh? Let's go see what's at the old weapon factory. You know, I can get some new weapons for my ship. Let's see what he's got. Uh, hey, buddy. So we can scan him. See what he's carrying. He's got energy cells, components, some steel. That's really all he has. What about you? Chemical plants. Uh, he's got that. Do you... Um, yeah, the other way. Would you... What do you want? You... I can buy small arms from you. And I can't sell any... Oh, I can sell things to you. Okay. Um, you have a job. Dire need of energy cells. Reward if I bring you 75 units. I'll give you... Give me some money if I do that. And the privates will like me better. What do you have? You're a chemical plant... You bring us 20 crystals. You have chemicals. And you're selling energy. You want energy cells. Yeah, okay. So, yeah. Again, we, we're just basically doing some trading here. And... Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a minute. What's going on over... No, no, no. I don't think so. I don't think so. Where are they all at? Go just... Oh. Did you actually destroy? You did actually destroy him. Good job, buddy. He's going back to working on it. Okay, cool. Who are you? Are you coming to shoot me? You better not be. I'm going to shoot you, buddy. What are you doing? I can I can hail you, right? Hello, pirate. Uh, what are you doing? I have no orders. Surrender your cargo. <laughs> Where's the nearest pirate base? None of your business. Surrender your cargo. Ow. Uh, shoot him. Oh, yeah, we got him. Easy. Okay, there we go. Get out of here, pirates. What are you doing? Okay. As long as you're not, as long as you're not doing anything. Solar plant being built. It's good. We're good. We're building things up at our base. How much longer do you have until this thing's done? 18% is going to be a little while. Uh, you guys, what I want you to do, I want you to... Actually, I have better orders for you. Protect this. New. Yeah, protect this guy. That's, that's all I want you to do. I don't care about protecting me. Protect the fabricator. Okay. So you do that. Uh, what's this? 
It's not mine. I think it might... Sirac. So are the Sirac out here? We're, we're the Sirac also, right? Um, diplomacy. Yeah, Sirac are out here also. They, I guess they're not too angry with me. They're just aggressive towards me. If we can do missions and we can make them happier and do fix the diplomacy and all that. Um, the trading station. Excellent. And, of course, we have our colonies there. Um, Alright. As soon as it's done, we can we can take a look at it and see how this, this base works. We can also build more bases. We can get uh, maybe a trading facility in here or something. Um, let's see what the solar power plant does. You Do you make energy cells? Because I, I know places that need energy cells. You do. I can buy them from you. Yeah, I'll buy them all. I don't have much cargo in here. I've got a decent amount, though. Yeah, buy all those. And, right, you guys needed cargo cells? I mean, I can make some money real quick. My traders are doing the same thing, but why don't I just do it? What do you want? You want uh, anything? We need energy cells. Bring us 50. Well, I got it. Okay. So, I got the job. Um... Done? I think I think we got it. I got it. I just got an achievement for it, so I think we got it. Okay, uh, I want to sell you the actually you know what? Let's just go to the other place. We're not making a lot of cash. We're just waiting for this thing to, to finish up here. Hey, uh, weapon factory, you need some uh Ciroc Empire. I'm putting bounties on basically everything of mine. You want energy cells? Well, I got them. Okay. And uh are we actually selling? I had 280 before. How many do I have right now? But, yeah. I'm losing 940. No, don't don't sell those. We don't want to lose money. We want to gain money. The whole idea here is to make money. What about you? Energy cells? No, crystals. All right, what if I sell you my energy crystals? Energy cells. Loss of a lot of money. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me just hang on to these. <laughs> Alright, alright. Are you done yet? Hurry up, base maker. I want to see it. How you doing? 96% here. It's almost done. Let's see it. Military base. There it is. Okay. New military base is here. Uh, now, I want to look at this military base. Alright. Station settings. Well defended military base. Build, rebuild patrol ships if things get broken. Um, you have a combat drone in here right now. Now I want to get my fabricator wherever he went. There he is. Where are you going? Um, where are you going? Hey. No. Back here. I want you to build me something else. Right here. I want you to put in a trading station, I guess. I don't think I can put in a shipyard. I'm not entirely sure why. But we can put in a trading station, and that seems like a good idea. Let's build one of those. That way we make some more cash here. We got a defense over here. We got a trading station coming in, right? Yes. Okay, and we got some patrol raptors hanging out over here, which are warping away for some reason. I don't know where they're going. Now, how are we doing as far as... Our, uh, our people. We haven't really expanded any. Has anybody expanded any? My cattle farm. Uh, anybody grown any? I don't think so. No one has expanded into into new space except for us. We got we got one system right here. If we um if we gain like I think we have to gain every planet, and then we get control of the system, which obviously the pirates have control of this one over here. Um. That wasn't there before, though, right? That's new. Lots of pirates over this way. Always pirates. But there's one of my traders going to do uh, tradey things. And how are we doing on our assets? Look at all the stuff we have now. Tons of things now. Lots of enforcers patrolling the sectors. Escorting the fabricator. Yeah, yeah. Um, let me go. Why is this guy doing nothing? Where are you? 
You're in Vesna too. Um, can I give you new orders? To do... Well, I don't want you to do anything. Just go scavenge. Sure. Yeah, sounds good. Be a scavenger. You're a builder, but whatever. Uh, Alright, so back... Over here. There's my military base. We are... Well, out... We're out here somewhere. Um, a pirate ward mine factory. In Vesna Nebula. So, we're, yeah, we're, I'm going to go look up there. I want to see all my stuff that we're making here. Uh, if I can click right. So, we've got, syst we got systems here. We've got some over here also. What do you made over here? Yeah, yeah. Military base, trading station. This is all a lot of new stuff, right? Because we were only in this one before, weren't we? Looking like a pretty good fleet, as if you'll say so myself. Bounty hunter, bounty hunter. These are things that are just being made. We've got a uh, independent bounty hunter, apparently. Some patrols around. Some traders are coming through our nebula here. Um, and then we have a... There's my chemical plants and food factories getting put in. Let's go. What's Anything over here? Yeah. Nook iron mine, crystal mine, silicon mine. Nice. We got miners doing their things. Patrols here also. Is there anybody actually doing any mining over here? It appears there's just... Oh, yeah, you are. Okay. Good, good. Okay. Ada Katana 3. My retribution is being attacked there. I saw that one. Where's that one at? Oh, that's over here. Over here. You're attacking me? Hang on, hang on. Let's go kill somebody. Where are they? Where's all my ships at? Did you destroy all my ships? Where's all my ships? Trading station's done, though. Trading station. What do you have? You got nothing. Um, you are buying drugs, slaves, and small arms? Of course you are. How about having some energy cells? Transfer those over. There you go. Sell those things for me, please. So traders should be coming in here and buying from us. I don't know where. There's one of my traders. Uh, is, are you coming in? Yeah, here we go. We got a trader coming in. So we should be able to watch this and see. What are you doing? Okay, just docking there. Oh, yeah. So he's docking here to go do some trading, which we can see there is now wheat in here that he has that he's dropped off. And someone else will come in and buy things. Are you shooting me? No, I don't think so, buddy. I don't think so. There we got we got our drones out to go get him. Oh, dang. Maybe he's dead. Okay, so yeah, so we, this is sort of more of the Empire part of the game, but if we wanted to, we could just be an individual ship flying around, which is where, um, let me go and to, let me go check this out real quick. There's the Empire part of the game. Let me look at, if we wanted to go into, sure, this is fine, into Neutral Trader, and this is all fine. Then we begin with just my ship and a tanker, and then we can come fly around here. We're just... In the middle of, I think, the Federation here. Of the uh, Independent Sector Alliance. So, um, we still have our assets of just myself and my uh, my tanker. This is like a cargo ship. There's really nothing nothing to us yet. Two ships, zero docks. We start with nothing. 45,000 credits. And we would come in here. If I get push the right button here. And we could go find ourselves a... Where are we? Here we are. Start off by like, maybe picking up some missions. Maybe getting some uh, some hauling missions like we saw before. We can get some haul uh, some hauling done. Now we can still go through and tell him this tanker to go do missions. Like we can go say, hey, you uh, instead of following me around, why don't you go and be a free trader? So he'll go and he'll go and do that, and we don't have to actually control him. Or we can tell him to follow us instead. You know, stick with me. Well, I gave him orders already. We can clear those orders, but. <laughs> Go, go do things and make me some cash. Uh, we've got a food factory over here. Again, we can come in and do some trading. We can go over and with my ship here, which has, if I can push me, has, um, oh, I have weapons on this thing. But if I, could, I could remove those things and put on some mining lasers. Or I could take my cargo hauler. It would be the better idea. Put some mining lasers on there, and we can go relive our Eve days and go do some mining in an asteroid belt somewhere around here. Uh, looks like there isn't one. There's one way up there. 
but go find ourselves an asteroid field and get some mining done and uh, just haul it in, sell it, go back, haul more in, sell it, and get up, work our way up to building, to being able to buy a building ship and maybe a trading station, that kind of thing, and we'll slowly get a bit of an empire going. Anyway, this is Unending Galaxy. It's been around for quite some time. It's on sale today, uh, I think for the rest of the month on itch.io. It's 250 um, You can actually get the game for free from their website. It's just a little bit less complete. This is a, the more complete version of the game. But I thought I'd show it off. It's it's uh, it's complex enough for uh, for this channel, and it makes my head hurt, and that means it's a good game. So thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time.